got a spring in my step. What's going on? I'm at Judge Chiropractic Center with Dr. Gergovich. He's the man that has been fixing me. I was very nervous about going to a chiropractor, but there go, comes a time when your back is so bad and you're in so much pain, literally moving and doing all that. But then I find out things like my allergies, my arm tingling, it's all related to the spine. This whole spine, all these nerves, how is that connected? So the brain is connected to the spinal cord. The spinal cord then has to send the message out the nerves and then into the organs. So a lot of people already know that chiropractic is good for like muscle issues and things like that. But then they also ask like, well, how is it related to my constipation? Or how is it related to my allergies? And mm -hmm. how is it related to my headaches? And, and the list goes on and on and on because if there's any of the misalignments in the spine that are putting pressure on the different nerves in that area that are going into those corresponding organs, of course the body's not gonna function like it should, right? Because we want full communication from the brain down the spinal cord, out the nerves, into those organs. And what was so interesting is that I was having tummy issues and I thought, oh, it's probably because I'm not eating right. Huge difference and sure enough, um, Dr. Gergovich, when you showed me that x-ray, because it's like a digital x-ray, or it's all fancy stuff, you can see, like this is what it, the healthy, right? What it's right. supposed to look like. Here in this area, it was like a sandwich. Absolutely. You know? So you had some misalignments in actually your hips, with the pelvic bones, right down here in the lower spine. We had some misalignments, and you can see how it could either rock forward, it could go backwards, it could rock in or out. And what that does is that pulls up on the leg and creates like an imbalance. But now when that misaligns, is not only is it pulling on the muscle, the muscle's then pulling on the lower back, which can cause the lower back pain. And then with uh, all the tension and the spasms, the misalignments, you can impinge on any of these nerves that are coming out and running down the leg. So then ding, 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 sciatica, very mm -hmm. common. Those same nerves that are branching off and running down the leg are the same nerves that are also branching off and then going into the bowel and the bladder for issues like that. Mm -hmm. And then I had neck issues, and so the neck is what was causing the, the tingling. And you were talking, last time I saw you, carpal tunnel, my mom had the surgery, didn't do any good. Right. I was having that same pain. It's not there anymore. It's going away. So. Right, so carpal tunnel can be an issue within the carpal tunnel or it can be an issue in the base of the neck. So all the nerves right here at the base of the neck and the upper part of the back are branching off and then running down the arm. So if there's any impingements there, it's gonna affect things like the numbness and tingling in the palms, the sore wrists, and things that people would think are carpal tunnel. Mm -hmm. so, right, so then they go to the doctor and then they, they examine the wrist and, and sometimes they say, you know what, you're not, you don't have carpal tunnel, it's coming from your neck. And they're, they're starting to come around to that and they understand that it, carpal tunnel would not be the issue. Mm -hmm. Dispel some myths about what you get. For example, you treat babies, you treat pregnant women. Talk about that a little bit. Okay, so everybody always, always is like, well, why would you take your kid to the chiropractor? Well, why not? So no matter what kind of birth that the, 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 um, the, the child has, when they're pulling the child out, they are working right in here, the bottom of the skull and the neck to pull that head out. So what can happen is oftentimes it can misalign the very top bones in the neck and that can kickstart all the issues. Right. Like scoliosis, right? How the tree grows. Right. So if you start off your life like this, where are you gonna keep going? Wow. This way. And then the body's gotta compensate to go back this way and then all your life you have something like this and you complain about constant back pain. It's just like the tires on a car, it's going to start breaking down and wearing down in other areas. So what's going to happen? Okay, it's going to get riddled with arthritis because mm -hmm. that's the uneven wearing and tearing of joints. I am so grateful that I saw you and I'm seeing you and we're on a plan now because we don't want more pain, do we? No. no. So we're on this plan now to get me, uh, and, and you don't want a straight spine actually, do you? No. Isn't, this is funny. You know, so this is from the front, straight. you want it straight. So as the camera's looking on, that's what you want. You want it straight, but now you turn to the side, you want to see three curves. One up in the neck, the middle part of the back, and the lower part of the back. Awesome. So people who spend a lot of time sitting at a desk all day long, their life looks like this, nonstop. Mm -hmm. So then when they, you know, you spend eight hours like this, and then you go up to go home, you can hear the spine creaking, Ooh. things get a little bit more stiff. Or and when so you get out of bed. 
That's the worst. You get out of bed and it's just like, I can't move. If you're hurting, it's so worth the visit because you know what you're talking about. <laughs> <laughs> and the best way to reach Dr. Gergovich is probably on your Just page. call in the office, check in our Facebook page, or uh, visit on the website, www.dr. Gergovich.com or it's right there, keying it in. <laughs> <laughs> Call the office 815-223-0647 or they can even shoot me an email. And I'll try to answer any questions as best I can for him. And he's doing all this and he's getting married soon. Can you believe that? Uh, seven more weeks. Congrats. Thank you. Seven weeks. And you will also see the lovely, wonderful Wendy who is just a doll. And maybe me when I'm here. <laughs>